if you're trying to watch your weight this holiday, and who isn't, uh, you're probably sick of hearing what not to eat, but there's some good news today. You don't have to miss out on anything. Here to show us how and have those healthy ways of eating all our favorite Thanksgiving foods is Christy Nickel from Code Red Fitness. So Christy, take it away and tell us how we can enjoy Thanksgiving and not feel guilty. Yeah, a lot of people do this whole, I can't have this, I can't have that, and they, they try to just make themselves feel guilty, but it yeah. doesn't have to be that way. So I have a couple of examples of how to make your traditional dishes healthier, just a bit better. Let's just try to clean it up a little bit. First one I want to show you are candied yams, traditional candied yams. Now, guys, uh, these can be pretty rough. I'm telling you, uh, you know, you've got a lot of carbs and sugar in these and a lot of calories. In fact, I'm just going to tell you um, a three-mile run. A three-mile run. <laughs> this equals a, a three-mile three mile run. run. So okay. if any of you want to come running with me to burn the, uh, no, I've got a better idea. If you just stick with good old-fashioned yams, look, whatever happened to the yam? Why did we have to make yams so bad? You know, this has got 88% less sugar and carbs and half the calories. So put some butter on them. They're good enough by themselves. Yams are not bad. Oh, they're delicious. They're and really I are. discovered that late in life, honestly. I had them like this too, but mm -hmm. growing up, but then they're really sweet in themselves. It, they're, they're good enough the way they are. They're good enough. Just leave the yams alone. <laughs> Just leave the yams alone. Another thing that is a traditional uh, a dish on all of our tables at Thanksgiving is mashed potatoes. Look, I'm an Idaho girl. Love I was our raised potatoes. here. I yeah. love my potatoes. I'm not saying, but guys, a healthy alternative to mashed potatoes are going to be mashed cauliflower and I'm telling you if you put a little bit of butter in them a little bit of uh, garlic in them whatever you want your family is not going to know the difference these are really healthy alternatives half the okay. carbs half the calories let's tell let's have a little secret you, those of you that are watching do this and see if anybody notices right. the difference. I mean, do you think they will? I don't, I can't tell. Okay. I think they taste a little better. Sorry, mom. I <laughs> think they taste a little better. I do. I think okay. they're creamy and they're good and they're healthy, guys. Yeah, all right. Well, those are great ideas mm -hmm. and those are pretty simple fixes. So if you can do some of this, you're basically cleaning things up. And I know you have a challenge underway right now. Tell us yeah. about that. Yeah, so I've got a challenge called the Code Red Holiday Hustle Challenge. And it is just to prevent holiday weight gain between Thanksgiving and New Year by following two simple sh rules. No shakes, no pills, no diet foods, and no exercise. Can you believe that? Code Red Holiday Hustle, because the average American, I don't know if you know this, gains 10 pounds wow. between Thanksgiving and New Year. That's a lot. No, it's not, it's it, it's not good. Okay. And so we can prevent that if you go to coderedholidayhustle.com and register. Let me help you through the holidays. I can get you through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, motivating, yes. motivating. That's what we need. All right, Christy, great to see you. Yes. Good ideas. And we'll be right back.